This was a bad idea. Hey guys, before the video starts, let's lay out some ground rules for this challenge. Rule 1, I have until the timer hits zero to paint. Rule 2, breaks will not count against me time-wise. And rule 3, I have to complete the full thousand point Blood Angel army within 24 hours. I started out by busting out my lead belcher spray to prime my Blood Angels. What I wanted to do with these Blood Angels is make a very metallic look with the blood angel. However, this is also where I made my first mistake. I had based them with another plane and then decided to go with a completely different plane later on in the video and had to go back and debase them. After 45 minutes, the lead belcher had settled and they were ready to be painted. I did not show it here, but I used a lighter silver through my airbrush to do a xenophil highlight and then I used a blood angel's red to paint my guys. This let them have a metallic look Look to the red. After a filming location change, I had around 21 hours left. Then I started base coating in black. Black would be the majority of my second color, so I wanted to get as much of that down as possible. This is also when I decided to paint the Aquilas on their chest black. It felt a little weird for me, because normally I use gold for the Aquilas, but hey, I think it turned out great. I proceeded to do the most tricky step of all, painting the eyes. I wanted to do a glowing effect with the eyes, so it was fine if I was a little messy because I would come back and clean it up later. I followed up by painting white on all the purity seals.
I finished off the painting session by doing the trim of the armor in gold. I did this by doing a really dark layer of gold and then highlighting a layer of gold on top of it. I also finished the specialty helmets that the blood angels use. This meant all my fast attack had yellow, all my devastator squads had blue, and all my veterans had gold. News flash. After 14 hours of painting, your hand's gonna start cramping and you're gonna question why you even started this journey. After my first break, I came back and I had to face the hard truth. I didn't like the way the librarian was turning out and I didn't really have any time to go back and fix him, so I ended up just dropping him. This still left me over a thousand points. Next I decided to work on the longest process of the whole painting. I would base them. The basing material is going to take a really long time to dry. My original plan to base them would be inside a space hall. However, in the middle of painting them, I came up with the idea of them being deployed on ball for reinforcements of the Indomitus Crusade, and that's why I had to retroactively change my basing. This might not be a newsflash to others, but you really shouldn't leave a paint bottle open on your desk while you're painting if you're a klutz. I ended up using the spilled paint off the table. I ended up using the green for both the eyes and for the purity seal. On top of the eyes I added in a lighter green tone. After another quick cleanup stage, this left us with just about an hour to go. To 
finish off my base, I decided to do a burnt umber red base coat of it and then dry brush several layers of orange consecutively getting lighter throughout it. With 14 minutes remaining, I'm kind of at crunch time here and I feel like I kind of screwed up, but it turned out good anyways. I was planning on pin washing these guys, but I didn't have time to pin wash them. So I just did a wash and tried to wipe out most of the stuff on top, but it still ended up tinting the armor color. In my book, there is only one color to use for your rim color on your bases, and that is black. This way you're actually sort of framing it like you'd frame a picture. Go! It's finally done! <laughs> it's finally done! You shall be forever known as Jimmy. Brother Jimmy. <laughs> There's only one thing you can do when you've spent 24 hours painting up miniatures and you have a camera. Sexy B-roll.
guys, this video took me a long time to make, so I'd really appreciate it if you'd go down, drop a like, subscribe, comment below what videos you want to see happen on this channel.